But if we live in certain parts of the country, we tend to hear certain messages over and over again. And so some of us may live in more conservative areas. Some of us may live in more liberal areas. What are you hearing? What I'm hearing from my constituents and from the, the people of my, my supporters, I'm genuinely hearing that they want us to be up here to fight. They don't want us to sit here and play partisan games. They don't want us to, to try and, and grapple with one another. They realize that there is indoctrination going on of an entire generation right under our noses. They realize that what's going on when they're trying to use the January 6th commission, uh, they're trying to put a January 6th on par with 9-11, which I believe is an insult to all of those survivors. And so I genuinely believe that the people in my district want us to be focused on real issues, not trying to sit here and, and debate if Liz Cheney should be uh, in a leadership position, which she shouldn't, so I'm glad she's gone. Uh, we shouldn't be sitting here just uh, playing partisan games. We should be getting real things done. We have an unsecured border. China is on the rise. We have Russian hackers who are so, so emboldened by the weakness of the current administration that they believe they can attack our critical infrastructure. Our, uh, the southern border is allowing people who are on terror watch lists to get into our country. Uh, the list of problems in our country goes on and on. And so the more that people sit up here and play partisan games and keep, keep, keep carrying on with genteel politics, uh, I say your days are numbered because it's time to fight.